hello are we are we recording am i youtubing all right gang it's been a little minute so i thought let's kick off with the good old-fashioned pin haul i at least know how to do that so hurry back just an 80s boy and a 90s teen going on all things disney from miles to parks and in between come share the magic with La 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 Live your life to a Disney tune Come and share Jake's Disney Afternoon Hey Disney Afternoon gang, thanks for returning to my channel And if you're new here, or if you've completely forgotten about me My name is Jake and I do all kinds of Disney content Including subscription boxes, swaps, hauls, pins, trips, vintage probably other things, but if it's Disney, we're doing it. So you're gonna wanna hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on the next Disney adventure. All right, I have to offer a big apology to my YouTube community. Life has been life uh, in the last month or so, and I have dropped the ball in so many ways, swaps and videos, communications and all of it. So I apologize and just going to pick myself up and keep moving forward. So I uh, hope you have me back and I am happy to be making videos because I have pin mail that is piled up for days. I do have swap videos that I need to get to and I'm going to try to get to a bunch of them today. I just thought maybe I wouldn't pick one to be the one to start with, so I thought I'd start a little neutral, and then I want to try to backlog as many swaps as I can. So stay tuned for those over the next day. So let's get cracking. Let's get off with a fantasy pin, because you know how I love a fantasy pin. So this is from Pin Board Bound, and I have ordered from them before. They did another Oliver pin, um... And these are, not only are they beautiful pins, but um, they are great um, prices and just lovely people. Uh, so thank you, Jake, for your order and continued support. I hope you love your new pin. And it is one of the sweetest from Oliver and Company. It is Dodger and Oliver. They're sleeping under their sort of makeshift uh, little bed and home with all their sort of garbage refuse. And then you've got the city in the background on that really gorgeous card. I sort of hate to separate it from the card, but, you know, I'm going to have to go on the pin board. So I'm going to add this to my little board. Um, but if you have not checked out Pin Board Bound, I will, of course, list them down below. Um, they're new to the design game, um, but they've got some things coming out. And like I said, good prices and good people. So definitely give them a check out. All right, let's do this set. I think <sighs> Disney Crazy Family, was this you who pointed it out to me on Facebook? Um, I had looked at this set. I think it's from Japan. Yeah. Uh, and a lot of sellers are selling it for a lot of money. And the seller was selling it for a very good price. It is the Powerline World Tour. Let me see if I can at least get this plastic cover off so that we don't have the glare. Um, I love Goofy Movie. I love Powerline. I love the soundtrack. I mean, the soundtrack, guys, come on. It's it's always on play. Okay, if you're going to have a flap there, there's no reason to then glue it down. Um, it is a great film. So I've been looking at these pins for a while. And when they were... Okay. Well, that's not how we open it. We may have to open this like caveman style. Because it is not budging. All right. Well, we're tearing it. We're tearing it because we want to see it. We want to take a good look. Uh, I have not been to a lot of pin sales lately for all of the reasons mentioned previously. Um, and I missed it. I, I missed the community. I missed the sellers. I miss Marcy and Diana and all of the gang. So hoping to be back in the new year. Okay, here we go. Look at the colors on these guys. You've got like sort of Goofy and Max. You've got them together with power line, you have just a power line, and then you have these sort of like neon uh, light situations. Yeah, those are cool. I love this sort of somewhat pastel -y but 90s colors. Okay, all the happiness in that. So thank you, Disney Crazy Family, for looking out for me. You know, that is one of the glorious things about our community, is that we are, okay, dropping things. 
uh, we're, we're always looking out for each other. So I appreciate it. And I appreciate all the comments in the last month um, from people who were concerned about me and worried and just sent really nice things. And, you know, people who need people are the luckiest people in the world. Okay, this next one is from Sam over at Pins and Things. Oh, Sam, I'm sorry if that's wrong. It's like the second you step away, it's like all of that sort of like common language you use like on a daily basis like disappears from your brain. Um, so this is another set I got from her and this is like a throwback vintage set right up my alley. Um, and so there is a old school TV with the old school Disney logo inside of it. You've got the VHS tape there. You've got a little Mickey Mouse hat with a like a heart diamondy thing in the middle. And then Disney is greater than everything. I mostly wanted the VHS. Ooh, it's a little rose goldy. Look at that. Uh, I mostly wanted the VHS and the TV, of course, but the others are super cute. So Sam, thanks for those. And then I also got a couple other things from her. Oh yeah. Okay. I literally don't remember anything. Um, so this is, a, this was five bucks. I don't really collect a lot of Toad from Wind in the Willows, but um, it is one of the classic ones. And you know, I love anything that's classic. So I had to kind of pick that up. And then this is a Captain Hook pin from 2017 Not So Scary Halloween Party. I'm not necessarily, I think this was like 50% off. So it was like 10 bucks. I'm not necessarily one to need the dates and the things on it, but, you know, why not add, oh, and look at it opens up to the croc waiting for, and you've got the skull in there. So it was a good price, good pin. Haven't added to my Peter Pan collection in a little minute. So thought we would do that. <coughs> also a cookie. Okay, uh, Dream 499 pins, Diana and Stu and crew over there. I have not been over there in a minute. I forgot I bought this. Ooh, I spent some money on a pin. It's the only pin I bought that time. This is probably the last sale I attended, too. Um, but I had been looking at this pin for a while, and it does go for a lot of money. So uh, they always have really good deals on pins over there. Um, really, truly, they do. So I would highly recommend. But this is from the Fairy Tales event from 2019. And, of course, it features a little Oliver and Company theme going on today. But, you know, they're some of my favorites. Although, <clears throat> the Oliver board is getting very full. All right, well, that's a problem for another day. So, this is from the Fairy Tales event, and it is... Let's see if I can grab the pin back there. Look at that. You've got the entire gang, Rita and... Uh, Frank and Dodger and Tito and Francis and Oliver, of course, on this giant, really good size pin. Um, yeah. Oh, and Oliver's a little pin on pin action. I didn't realize that. So you've got, yeah. Another awesome one for the board. Uh, <clears throat> that one was enough. So that's all I spent that time. Uh, okay. <clears throat> Excuse me. All right. Two more packages to go. This is another fantasy pin, and I reached out to a few people, and I was like, is this the flower from Alice? <gasps> Look at this little drawing on this card, and it is the flower from Alice. That's super cool. Thank you. Uh, this is from Marianne in White Plains, Maryland. Uh, thank you, Jake. I'm so glad I was able to help you add to your flowers collection. You know I love the flowers. I enjoy watching your videos very much. Oh, thank you. Take care, and happy pinning. Uh, Marianne, oh, from Ride the Waves with a Mermaid. That's right. You know, sometimes I forget where I know people from. But anyway, definitely we'll link her down below. And this is a really gorgeous pin. This is the Daisy. And yeah, super cute. I love that it's like I sort of had to wonder, like the design is very much from the film. But because there were no eyes and no uh, sort of you know, cartoony features. You'll see in just a second here. Um, I was a little unsure, but look how cute that is and all that sparkle in there. That's going to go nice. I'm going to maybe have like a flowers only collection one day if it gets big enough. <sighs> we'll see. Okay, then let's finish this out strong with my old pal Marcy Mouse, who was so sweet and reached out to me the other day. And again, I am just grateful for everybody who has said something and come along and 
Notice my absence from it. it. You know, it reminds us why we do this stuff. So there's Marcy. If you don't know Marcy, you're living under a rock. Go check her out. This was one of the freebies. So that'll go in some little giveaway or swap something. But super cute kind of leather bracelet with Grogu in the middle. Um, and then I literally have no idea what I bought because it has been like, I don't know how long, but this one is... Okay. Oh, yes. I vaguely remember. Okay. So this looks mostly Alice themed, I think, which, you know, we're okay with that. Oh, this one's cool. So this is a limited edition of 5,000 and it is the Queen of Hearts, my gal, but also it features like one of these original sketch drawings and you know how I feel about the animation. Um, so look, it's like a two pin deal. So you've got the Queen fully realized and then you have this sort of like I think we jokingly called her like the ugly, oh no, I think the ugly queen is coming, hold. Um, but it has this sort of original sketch work of sort of art leading up to the final design. So I love that kind of history. Um, yeah, makes me smile. Oh, and there's another, oh, oh, okay. So now I need to know how many are in this series because here's another one uh, of Captain Hook in the same exact thing. It's the final hook and then like a, a draft version of one of the early designs. So I got to know now, would somebody tell me if you know, like, is this a whole series? Is it all villains? Is it lots of characters? Um, because I would definitely be interested. So you've got that sort of crazy hook there, and then you've got the final version. So there they are kind of side by side. Those are super cool. So yeah, somebody let me know down below what the deal is on those. And then finally, one more Alice. Okay, so the crazy... Is she up there? The crazy queen. She was crazy. I don't know. She was crazy. Um, so this is the Mad Hatter pouring some tea. And it was a super cute, just a little pin. Uh, it's a... Can't read what it says. But, you know, I buy for the aesthetics anyway. So there he is. Yeah, super cute. All right, so there's that part of the haul, and then a couple loose ones, and the uh, Goofy Movie um, set. Fun pins. Uh, feels good to be back and recording and hoping to get back on track. Again, thank you to everybody for your patience and uh, love and support. Tis the season, and I could not be more grateful. So leave me a comment down below. What was your favorite pin of the day? Don't forget to like the video. Please hit subscribe. I will be posting more regularly, I promise. And I hope to see you all soon on the next Disney afternoon.